everybody. It's me, RJ, and today we are last tipping my bow tie. My bow tie. I'm gonna show you the front. I did it a little while ago, uh, like three months ago. This was able to pull off and do it, and it needs to be clean because there's, you know, bug guts and stuff, and it's a little scrape, but a little scratch. I don't know if it's for me or other stuff just hitting it because driving on the road, but you look back, it looks pretty sweet, okay? Oh, I don't know if you know, but the bow ties on the avalanche is probably doing other cars. They start uh, getting water in there. There's a spot there, and down here it's deteriorating. The front just looked horrible. It was like black, moldy looking from the paint wearing away from water getting in there. So, got some plastic dip. Like I said, prepare it all. And after you're done, wipe down your bow tie with some alcohol. A clean cloth that doesn't leave fabric. And then sit for a minute and let it dry out. And get to work here we go there's one coat and it's not you know see it's it's black but you can still see all that stuff I'm gonna let it dry for a second it doesn't take that long with this and then I'm gonna hit it up with some more okay so try to spray as you can see I made a mess out it's because I start out here to get this first spray going past it past it so you don't make any blotches on it all right see in a few so here we go second coat's done and it's a little more, you probably on the phone, it probably looks black, but it's not. So, there you go. And just keep at it, let it dry for a few minutes, come back and hit some more. There's the third coat. I'm trying to go light and do it a little layers at a time, see? Looks pretty good, it's getting dark. Um, I'm setting a timer for three minutes to make myself wait for it to dry. It's really windy, so it's drying fast, and Plastic Dip dries pretty quick. Um, you could wait longer if you wanted, but... I'm doing three minutes because I know when I wasn't timing it a few minutes ago, I was going too fast. It was like a minute and a half I checked. So, do three minutes or longer, set a timer, come back, hit it a little more. Light layers should be good. And you know, if you're bored while you're waiting, you can just read, catch up on some news, see what's going on. Win second St. Louis City Championship Golf Tournament. Ball tips for your pet. There you go. All right, get some pizza. Look at dog grooming. Yeah. Ghost pepper cheese sandwich. Mm. You may not care. Uh, um, it's spicy. It is spicy. I'm going to take some spray. Blast dip in the mouth to cool off the spiciness. I think that's coat five or six. You guys know. Damn, there you go. It's getting there. Gonna have it looking sweet. All right. Okay, whatever coat I was on then I did at least two more since then I was on the phone and just busy so at least two more so I'm like seven or eight so here we go yes you could do less coats but it comes out a little better if you do I'm a little worried on that coat This one, that one's spraying better, but it's almost out. There it goes, it's settling by covering it with more. I'm not gonna do about it. If I touch it, I'm gonna ruin it. Luckily, it's plastic dip, so if it gets old and I don't like it, you just grab it, peel it off, start over. I'm not gonna do that today though. I'll do it like in a while after it gets dirty. Dang it, look at that. When it, dries, when it dries, it should be all right. Yeah. Back here, you can't see it that bad. Mm -hmm. All right, pause it. Scooby. Okay, right here we go, like eight, nine coats. I probably went a little overboard. It's a little rough looking, but it kind of, it looks like if you've seen on an avalanche, this. So it kind of looks like I meant to do it. We'll see. My other one came out a lot better, I think. Well, this ain't completely dry yet, though, so. This could come out. No, I got, I got it. You're the camp person. No, 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 no. Stop, please. Right. If you peel it off the thing, it will peel the paint with it. You just want to rip it off. Sorry, everyone. It's like unwrapping a present. It's not a present, though. If you peel it around here too hard, it will peel the paint. Everything around. Here, you can pull that one. 
Go ahead. Go. No, I can't touch it. I'm holding the camera. Pull it. Shh. It isn't nothing to do with holding the camera. I can't do it. I can't do it. Y'all see what I'm dealing with? <laughs> it's a deal with that I didn't want you peeling the paint that I just spent an hour on. That's your fault. It's <laughs> <Just> my fault? <laughs> Uh -oh. Okay, so you can't even do it. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Careful, it's a little wet. That's what she said. See, look, see that? See what it does? Yeah. What? It peels. It peels. Show video? Yeah. We can see the progress as we go. Here we go, here we go. It's gonna be exciting. Exciting. Gotta be careful, I don't. It's not all completely dry, so. Now, it helped for me today. It's like 70 degrees and like. 20 mile on our winds or less are close to it, so it's uh, drying really fast. Layer by layer. See that? This is what else. Show them. Well, I was telling you how you can peel it off. This is what plastic dip turns into. So, you get ready, you can. I got a big old ball of paper in my balls. Oh, 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 oh. Careful. Careful, careful, careful. Layer by layer. it off would be stupid. Stupid. Okay. So make sure when you're doing the blast dip that you're cleaning the blast dip. Tell you, after you put your tape on, I didn't show that. I razored with a razor on the tape. So that's how I'm getting the nice clean, not tearing too bad. Probably would want to maybe razor it after it dried if you wait all the way till full dry to take it off. And uh, Scooby wanted to come say hi. So, Scooby. Scooby! Up, 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 up. So, maybe they did it too soon, but it could be that it waited too long because it dries and gets stronger like that. Really strong right there. I'm gonna get the razor and lightly cut that. Kind of sweet, didn't mean to do it. Ready? Get your razor and lightly cut through there so you don't peel it. video and I used a razor to cut that part off because it was connecting but look see the plastic with the bumps see the bumps it looks like I meant to do it I mean it kind of looks pretty sweet it's like I'm a genius I really did that on accident guys but I, 
I love it. I like it. The front one was smoother, but because of that there. And there you go. It covers it up. You don't have that ugly, rusty water damage inside there. And man, I mean, just look at that. Yeah. So, that's it, y'all. That's my plastic dip thing, and it's dry. I mean, like, it dries quick. So, that's all I got. Questions, ask below. Not a lot of questions. Make sure you use it. Make sure you use a razor to cut the tape after you lay it on. I used all tape first to make the shape, cut it around the bow tie, then put newspaper over, okay? That's all I got. As always, I'm RJ. Seize the day, each and every day.